Well, let, let's talk about that for a second. Give us some examples of transactions you've worked on, led, uh, with some of the names that, that the students would know uh, in the past 10, 15 years. Well, like I sold, uh, I took, I devised, I did, wrote the business plan for taking DreamWorks Animation public, supervised it, hired Goldman Sachs, took them public. I sold, I, I was the lead guy, sold a, a DreamWorks live action to uh, a Paramount, then I, uh, then when it all fell apart and everybody was not working together, then I settled them out, raised the financing, did a deal, a new deal. Uh, for uh, for Steven and, and the crew, uh, you know Pixar. Obviously, we did all the deals at Disney. Uh, I can't take much credit for the sale. I think Steve did that, but we did all the all of the uh, the Disney deals and designed des designed all the strategy. Um, but we have I have uh, well mo well more than half of the outside financing in the industry I personally represent. So if you're going to make a big movie. One way or another, it comes to one of my clients. I set up another animation company recently called uh, Illumination for a guy named Chris Melodandre, which did Despicable Me, and now they have Hop. I really believed in Chris. Uh, he was an executive Fox, so I helped him do that. First thing you got to do is you got to identify the talent, you got to believe in them, and think they're the real deal. Um, so the first decision is who you get in business with. So uh, I have a company called Working Title. It's the biggest, uh, the biggest title, the biggest production company in Europe. And so I have some, like the biggest production company in India. And you know, we're kind of raising money all over the world from Abu Dhabi, China, you know, you name it. 